you know, you're not just building software. Like we want to get to the place where um, if, if you ever grew up in a house where an envelope arrived and, and dropped in the morning and your mother looked at it and went, uh, you know, she went white. Yeah. And you knew that she did not know how she's going to pay that bill. If you've ever lived in that world, that moment is just something that you never want to see in a house. And the ripple effects of that, like if you grew up in a house where the tensions are so high because you don't know what you're going to do about how to pay these bills. Like that makes for a very difficult home life. Yeah. And it makes for a di very difficult personal life. There's some sort of mission about what we're trying to do, right? Imagine that if you move people to a situation where they didn't miss that one bill, that didn't trigger that one thing, that didn't cause their mother to go, you know, and do something terrible. Brilliant. Priceless. Right? It, that's, and it doesn't have to happen. That's this, like where you see stupidity. Like you see, this is a stupid way of doing things. Yeah. You go, well, well it, got, you, you, be you don't have right? the information. So basically, like I saw on your video this morning, you're basically using AI for the betterment uh, of humanity, for the betterment of people's life, because there's nothing more important than being able to feed yourself and keep your lights on. You've got to get yourself into the conversations. Exactly. We're tilting that table, you know, five or ten percent one way or the other has really significant effects. Yeah. And like if we're talking to a million people and we're managing some of those conversations and we're able to say, hey, let's explore a little bit here. Let's give a little bit of flexibility there. Let's try and find out a little bit more there. And and X amount of people don't like find themselves homeless at the end of the week or find themselves with enough money to pay for the groceries. You know, that is going to make a difference. Now, we 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 think that like if you look at there's some like go look at the go look at the amount of money that people pay on overdraft fees, late payment fees, penalties. Right? Just go look. Yeah. At the scale of that business. Now, off the top of my head, again, I think it's in the kind of area of around 40 billion. 